Hey, the Break Master here, and this is going to be Break Time. And this week's Break Time is going to be something that I don't know if anyone's actually been talk has talked about, actually. I'm just, you know, and I want to get people's opinions on this, because I've been thinking about this, and I'm just wondering if this is a ploy or not. Basically, the sum of this story is, is, um, anime not following manga equals money. And now what I mean by that title is, um, a good example of a series that doesn't follow the manga, um, and then they make they remake a sh they make re they basically remake the show afterwards, which is um, um Full Alchemist, Full Alchemist, you know Full Alchemist and Full Alchemist Brotherhood. So, you know they f made Full Alchemist and you know they went along with it. The re I, I don't know I don't know what the reason exactly was not to stop following the manga and stuff. They they follow the manga I'm pretty sure the first part of it and then they just drift off completely and made their own kind of story. Now what I want to know is do they do this on purpose so they can then make more money for their series? Like, just like to test how popular the show can be, and then be like, okay, now it's follow the manga, and then boom, that's even more popular because people are already into the show in some way because they already seen, you know, the fillerish kind of series that they had. A, a good example of this that might happen that I'm wondering is, um, I know Exorcist. People have been complaining about I know Exorcist because it hasn't been following the manga anymore, and it's like did a it did a, a complete U-turn. From the um series from the manga completely so now it's just like off of it completely at this point and so i'm wondering because just because you gotta think about this but you know i know x is a very popular series and i'm i can i can see this being employed to make them to get some more money out of this so they can then recreate the series like a, a year later to make more money off the series for the, for the creators i wonder if this is what they usually do for a series i mean the two main known ones I know is Iron X and Fuma Alchemist. Fuma Alchemist is the most blatant one I can rem I can remember because you know I'm not give, give or take. Fuma Alchemist was good. I, I like it, but I like Fuma Alchemist Bro Brotherhood way better only because the story was just oh it's it's, it's really good. <laughs> and I don't I don't I don't really mind that. I just I'm just seeing that maybe this is a, some kind of trick or a ploy that's that they that they try to do each time for a series. Only, maybe this, or they just try to do it to test the waters of the anime and just see how it go. Because they've always followed the first episode, like through, kind of like the manga in some ways, to see if people are gonna like it. And so then they end up following away, like away from the manga, and then just make some whacked out series. You know, they, they did what they did with Dead Man Wonderland. Yeah, they did with Dead Man Wonderland. And it's possible they might recreate that show and make a, um, you know, more profit off of it because because that was also a very popular series. You know, I think they're just trying to test whether or not the, sh the series is going to be very popular or not. And if it's not popular, then there's no point in making the series into the manga, I guess. Because, you know, like, eh, no one's really going to buy this. You know, to test the waters, how much it's get bought and all that other stuff. So, if it gets, like, sold out and bought, like, crazy all the time, it wouldn't hurt for them to then recreate it to follow the manga. Because people want that, want that more than the filler. So, then the people are going to buy that also. And then, you know, you want to support the series and support manga and anime. So, you, you're going to buy it and stuff. So, yeah, so, I, just, I, I don't know. I just think it's just, it's just a big money um, chain that's try, that they're trying to do at this point. That's what, that's what it seems like. It's some kind of trick to try to trick us to, to buy this, all, this mo all this anime and, and stuff, and, you know, just, just, to, just, to, just to get us and then bring out a new series of the same show, basically, kind of watered down at the first part of the, part, first, first part of the um, you know, series, but then it gets better later on. But I don't know. I, I just, this is just my opinion on, on that. I, th I think there's money, trying to be money grubbers and just trying to get as much money as they can out of each series, and because I mean, I, it's, it's a good because they're good ideas and stuff. So they just try to like you know try to change it up or something. I don't know, I don't know. So you know, leave a comment below and tell me what you think of this. Do you think they um, purposely um, make the shows not follow the manga so then later on they can make the shows follow the manga to make more profit off the you know series, or or is this or is this just, or is this just a test? To see whether or not a uh, show is popular, and then they can veer off and then make more money later on. The whole point is, that I, I think they've been trying to make they're just trying to make a lot more money than they can. They they're not they're not, they're not supposed to honestly at this point. I, that's what I think anyway. I mean, I don't know. Leave a comment below and tell me what you think of this you know little topic here because you know this is something I've been wondering and wonder people think about this and you know people buy people buy the series anyway. So I mean, you know, <laughs> that's just, so it's just like it's more money for them. More money! <laughs> so yeah, it's been the Breakmaster. It's been break time. And I'll see you guys next Thursday. So until then, break out.